Now he goes head to head against Rocker tonight. True leadoff Peter. The 3 1. A lot of movement, but ran inside on Bradfield, and that's a leadoff walk. Carter Young, sophomore shortstop, switch hitter. Looks at ball four inside. Back to back walks the opening to open the frame. And the hands are on the side, which means that ball's going to move a little bit more in towards the right hander. Slider right there. He, I, by my count, he's throwing four sliders. Here's a two one from Aleman. Lifted into center field. Fabian coming in. Rivera back. Second baseman makes the play and gets it off quickly. One two pitch. The ground ball up the middle. Coming around is Rivera. Throw to first. Late. Another run coming home. He's safe. And those first two walks come home to loose on an infield single from the catcher. 2 nothing, Bandy. How about Carter Young on this, too? And this fastball gets in on the hands of C.J. Rodriguez. Wood bat. It blows the bat up. You probably don't even throw to first. But instead, you can see where Jordan Carey on the shortstop starts. Off the top of the mound. Pops up. And instead, Rivera makes the play. It's Carter Young who starts on second base. Drops the bunt up the third base line. That'll stay fair. Halter has no play. And everybody's safe. One two pitch. Fly ball into right center. It's Fabian up near the track. Catch made to end the inning, but Jacob Young will be able to tell those same stories and get a couple knocks this weekend. Strikeout against a really good <laughs> offensive lineup in Mississippi State. And that one will get through against the shift still. Beat it. Bradfield will bring it back in, and Nathan Hickey with a one-out single. Egan holding Hickey at first. Here's the 1-1. One -one. Fly ball. Will barely leave the infield. This is Colwick, the second baseman. That was up there for a while. Two down. Here's the 0-2. Went with it and got him. A couple of Ks in the first for Rocker. The second for Vandy. And he sends a shot to center field. Fabian on the run. It'll be over his head and hop against the fence right in front of the Adirondacks. The chairs, not the mountains. And it's a stand-up double for Tate Colwin. Definitely first year doing that. Sharply hit right side through the hole. Colwick around third, and they'll stop. Sterling Thompson gets it back in, and Vandy has the first two runners on in an inning for the second time tonight. Struck out this year. Probably why they held him at third. Bradfield drops a drag down. Nobody covering first. It gets a run home. And Bradfield scoots down the line. They can just do some things to you. That watch, watch the eyes of Bradfield in the second baseman. He knows exactly if you get it that way and if Armstrong breaks. You have zero chance if you're Josh Rivera to beat him to first base. 2 2 pitch. Up and in. Got him. That's the guy in the jersey. Fastball's been okay. The slider, he's had a hard time finding that fastball. That is a fair ball Shot into the, the corner. Right line again. Thompson digs it out. Two runs have scored. And it'll be a double for Jack Bulger to bring a pair home. The problem with the fastball tonight has been where it's been in the zone, and it's been elevated. Consistently elevated, it, it does not have any sense. So the movement is our inside movement back. And he pokes this one the opposite way into Rivera's glove. He'll take the out and surrender a run. It's now 6-0. Something that you just don't see right now. You just got to make sure that you're as ready as possible for tomorrow, and you never know. You run into a few. Get yourself back into it. You look at it differently, but so far it's all banded. Three home runs and 16 driven in for Thompson. Room for Jack Bulger. With Jack Leiter waiting for tomorrow. Cadillac drives it high and deep to center field. Ball not carrying, and Bradfield will haul it in. 3-1 pitch. 
And Kumar kind of fell off the mound with that delivery. It's his first walk of the night. All over Achiever. 1-1. Shift is on. Swing and a miss. Throw to second with a runner going. Got him! What a throw by C.J. Rodriguez to end the inning. On a base hit. Guys in the dugout. Every time I try to tell the story of two outs. Every time. Contact off the barrel. There's a walk. Breaking ball strike three called. Swing and a miss. Strike at number four. Hack gone again. Another K. Little dribbler off the end of the bat. That's Gonzalez with the hand. They couldn't get him. Against the shift. Third baseman playing over with a short sap would be up. Fabian's got a seven game hit streak going. Clean there, ground ball up the middle. Gonzalez reaches that one. Pardon me, that's Young, and he takes care of them for the third out. Games an hour early when nobody else was there. And so the preparation piece has always been there for Kumar, and it's just continued all the way through. Bradfield leadoff single. Time since it's happened. There goes Bradfield. Throw down to second is late. And out for 90 feet if the next guy's going to hit it over the fence. Here's a line drive to center field. Bradfield around third. Fabian lost it for a moment. And it'll be an RBI double for Dominic Keegan. And Enrique Bradfield's already dirtied up that uniform good with a couple of bags. And now his third run of the night. Andy Ketcher, one of the tops in the SEC and on base percentage. And he flies it to the left side. This will be carry on. Alamont had a little fist bump there. I saw the live tweeting, by the way. Yeah, this one rocketed it. deep to right. It is past the berm. Armstrong straightens it out for his fifth home run of the season. All right, so best raw power in the SEC. I'll put Wes Clark up there. This catch right there, too. When he gets it, it is majestic, and there is no doubt about this one. And on the mound, if you're going to give one up, I I'd rather give this one up because for a, a brief second, it's kind of fun to watch. And he hits a hard line drive to right and right at Isaiah Thomas. You can nitpick on Kamar Rocker. It's that, just the ability to stay locked in. And it's not anything that that I think is is honestly a negative. I mean, I, th I think it's pretty normal. Um, the three-one ground ball left side stab knocked down Young. Throw to first is late, and the Gators have a pair of board with two out. <laughs> if you go look at my prom picture when I was a senior <laughs> and compare it to that. <laughs> Yeah. That's a strikeout to end the game. Was I a dork? <laughs> Nolan stings one into center field. It's his second hit of the night. Flo Florida came in having won eight of nine. Leiter has certainly looked beatable last couple. He has won a game in his last two. Straight away center. It is gone. Slides past the batter's eye, and Isaiah Thomas gets his first hit of the night. It's a loud one, a two-run shot. He can do this to you now. We talked about it earlier, and, and the, the tools are off the charts for Thomas. Just a lot of swing and miss. But when he gets it, and when he gets a slider that stays over the middle of the plate, got a chance to go a long way. Watch this reaction. I believe they're still playing. Ground ball up the middle. Rocker slipped again, reached by Young, but he couldn't glove it. And nothing hogs in Baton Rouge. Ooh. That one off the chest protector of uh, Rodriguez, and Young will advance on a wild pitch. It's three or four weeks. There's some clubs that, at least as of today, would be hosts that may not look like hosts in three or four weeks, and it gives you the freedom to run through the process of how to set up for the testing, whatever protocols they needed to meet. Ground ball to first. And that'll get a run home. And, and 
It is um, for Armstrong. And that one skips all the way to the backstop and a high carom. Fabian. Swing and a miss on a pitch in the dirt. Rodriguez will throw down to finish it off. Another one. Strikeout number eight for Kamar Rocker. Steady died of breaking balls. This for Florida was. Whoa, this one is lasered into the gap in right center. Fabian lays out, comes up empty. It's against the fence. Young to second without breaking stride. Headed for third. He is standing up with a leadoff triple. So what kind of ornaments would you hang on that thing at this time of year? Who are we into now? A little time this afternoon. One ball down the line. That is a fair ball. Halter trying to show off, and his throw is a little bit wide. To short, carry on to Rivera, on to Armstrong, a 6-4-3. And he yanks it to the right side, flagged down by Rivera. 1976. He could start with that, too, if he wanted to. <laughs> Line drive, right center field, headed for the Adirondacks. Grab your chair, we got extra bases. Carousel roll and Halter scores. Rivera comes around. Home team rallying in the sixth. Beat Wichita, Wichita State 10 zip, and then they lost to Wichita State 12 to 2. And Fabian jumps all over the first offering. Gators have loaded the bases. Good pace. Here's the 2 2. Climb the ladder on him. Got a big strikeout to end the inning. Sharply hit. And he's got a two-hit game. What do you make of I'd one two? There's just not that many teams that make a run in a postseason. I thought they hit them out of the bat. We'll see if it hit his hands. Season in 78 either. I believe they won it all in 79. And a tapper with a drawn in infield, the run will come home. Ground ball. Rivera. Could get the boys back there. On top of the Pac-12 right now, and at least as of today, with a really good chance to host. Third home run of the year for Anderson. Sharply hit, gathered by Rivera. Had told me they would look good. Deep fly ball left field. Home run, Jacob Young is third of the year. Were you at least wearing a jacket over the suspenders off the cap with a roller? Here's Gonzalez again. And that one's late. Chopper, Gonzalez, laser. Hi, pulled Keegan off the bag. And the next two have reached, and Gator's not done yet. No, this one's a shot to the gap. Whoa, Bulls are nowhere close to it. Bradfield backing him up. Hickey has scored. Fabian to third. He'll stop there. It's a run scoring double for Chris Armstrong. He was driven in three tonight. To the left side, Gonzalez backhand off balance late. He was lucky Gonzalez was to even get there to run scoring infield single for Halter. Season has gone. One swing has gone the wrong way. Beautiful pitch. Strikeout strands a pair. And, and had met Mike Cameron, but for whatever reason, when they came down to me on the field, I forgot Mike Cameron's name. Team one of Bandy when they got the win, one series. Swing and a miss. 11 to 7 is the final. Vandy with 13 hits. Florida had 13 hits, but they left a ton on base.